It may be a sign of a true turnaround from the recession. Companies hired more employees in the last few months than in the past 17 years. 41 Action News reporter Jodian Thompson has the report, and those numbers include small businesses, Jodian. Yeah, they do, Chris. And right now, new jobs reports show that 257,000 new jobs were added in the U.S. in January. And in our area, we have many small businesses like Mildred's Coffee House and Bistro. Every hire they add, Goes into that larger number. Mildred's what can I do for you? Is family owned and has been operating for more Good than job, two decades, including this location in the crossroads. <laughs> Evan Ashby is part of that family and says they have almost doubled their sales in the last few years. From 7 a.m. to 4 p.m., we probably had four people working. And right now, if we're getting ready for the lunch rush, we have seven people working. So it's a pretty Pretty big difference in terms of our staff numbers. And now, according to a new jobs report, many of the 257,000 new jobs added in January across the U.S. are coming from small businesses like Mildred's. Scott Engelmeyer at Workforce Partnership says there are many more people who weren't looking for a job before who are now. A number like 257,000 shows that we're creating jobs beyond what we need to just to keep keep uh, it pace with population growth. And in Kansas, the unemployment rate is at 4.2 percent. In Missouri, it's 5.4. Both numbers lower than the national average. This is kind of the cool part, really. Ashby says they were selling coffee when the recession first hit, and it wasn't just the aroma luring people in. The biggest um, part about that is the golden rule. You treat people the way you want to be treated. And now they are expanding this location, a sign of what experts hope to see happen all across the country. And the report also points to a few industries which saw the most growth on top construction, then healthcare, trade, manufacturing, and financial activities. Krista, back to you.